fork in. Fork on. All right, let's put some oil in here. I didn't know if that was enough vegetable oil either. Um, could you a little more? Well, you can put some more in there. If you would, thank you. Okay. You can. You can what? Put this away. Please. Please. All right, Mr. Jim. We're gonna wait for that a little bit now. Mm -hmm. But did you? Do it up real good. Oh gosh, I don't know. Mix that water and stuff in it. Yep. There. Mm -hmm. Okay. And and dry them. You can bring, you can bring the whole thing up here mm -hmm. if you want. Put them up here and dry them out. Because that the thing is, if you don't do that, then the flour doesn't stick to the to the mm -hmm. dish. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Let me see how warm this is now. Mm. Now dry the top off. Nice. That's it. Okay. Both of them. All of them. Mm. Okay. Then you can put them in the flour, and it'll stick to it better now. That's a big one and it'll take a little longer to, to cook, so you can put it in there now if you want. Mm -hmm. That's it. Be, be real careful though. You don't want to splash it. No, it won't burn won't, yourself. slip on my hand, so. Put it in all well, the way down, gently. Mm -hmm. Don't drop it. Just put it down gently. There you go. Now you got it. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Handle it covering the ship. You can let that sit in there and the bread comes, you won't hurt anything. Uh -huh. I'll be glad to get more of these this season. Yep. Yeah. Here goes the bread. Yeah, we are. Okay. 
Yeah. 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 So should these wait at all? Um, no, let's take a look at them. Turn them over and see if you think they're nice and brown. You're all set. Ah, they still got some ways to go. Okay, we can put the other ones in there. Then. All right. Number one. That's it. That's exactly the way you should do it. Yep, that's how you should do it. <laughs> Uh, looks like, uh, perfect. It's going to be pretty quiet when we go to lunch tomorrow. Three more. Oh my gosh. Oh, shake that up a little bit. Okay. And just turn it over. Well, I put after it. Well, it's small, isn't it? Yep. I might do it. Okay. I did look up at Wingett's place in Dover. I've never been there. I've heard, heard about it. I've never went there. We said, man, the menu looks really good. Wings must be good. But they're stuffy, so there must be oh, five of them. Five wings for 13 bucks. That's what it's called. The other kind of father's dress. $13 for one of them. Alright, number one. I'm going to wash it right now, water, so I don't care, yeah, I'm just gonna separate the crap from the fish. I looked at the menu for the one ten grill on it. It doesn't trim me on it. I don't want to cook at all. I don't way, either. Way overpriced. I know. I was in there one day just the other drink. I thought it was going to drink for a while ago. Nine bucks for a gin and pachai, not a gin and vodka pint. Nine bucks. And it wasn't even, it wasn't even a real top shelf one, you know? It's just crazy. I never went back there again. I will tell you, I know that you're not going to go there, but. No more. The crab quesadilla in Pepper's Landing is so good. I know you like it's that. It's only 11 bucks. It's an appetizer. It's only 11 bucks. That's, you, you would not be able to eat it all. Terrific. All right. This is the last one. First, aren't you? Yeah. Yep. All right, let me get another plate and I'll. There we go. All right. Some good fish. Mm. Yeah, it's a it's a lot fresher than I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> oh, that's good. Yep. It's been been for like a year. You never know how how bad it's gonna turn out.